The following is a brief presentation on the middle school graduation requirements for Black River Public School. Please keep in mind that full class descriptions are available in the program of study, which can be found with your CAP teacher and on the Black River website. In the program of study, you will find details about courses, including eligible grade levels and prerequisites. In order to graduate from middle school at Black River, students must complete the following credits. Three credits of English, three credits of math, three credits of science, three credits of history, two credits of Spanish, two credits of fine arts, one PE credit or two G period courses, and one credit of electives. In addition to the above, all middle school students are required to pass three years of project term and complete 20 hours of community service. Middle school students are generally required to enroll in seven courses. Middle school students are encouraged to take advanced courses at the high school level when appropriate. However, most colleges and universities only recognize work completed between grades 9 and 12. Middle school English courses are as follows. In sixth grade, students will take English 6, focusing on Africa, Middle East, and Latin America. In seventh grade, students enroll in English 7, focused on Asia. And in eighth grade, they will take English 8, focused on early Europe. Middle school English classes at Black River are designed in collaboration with history classes to study a specific geographic area each year. Social studies classes can be seen as follows. In sixth grade, students will take History 6, again focused on Africa, the Middle East, and Latin America. In seventh grade, they will be enrolled in History 7, focused on Asia. And in eighth grade, complete History 8, focused on early Europe. For math during middle school, students need to take three courses. Before the start of the program, students are encouraged to take a placement test to determine where they should begin. Because of the integrated nature of our program, students may be given the opportunity to advance past their currently enrolled grade level. If seeking advancement, please contact the Mathematics Department Chair for more details. In 6th grade, students begin with Integrated Math 1. In 7th grade, they will be enrolled in Integrated Math 2, followed by Integrated Math 3 during 8th grade. Advanced students should follow the high school flowchart, which is included at the end of this presentation. During middle school, students will complete the following middle school science courses. In sixth grade, they will take earth science. In seventh grade, they will be enrolled in life science. And in eighth grade, they will complete physical science. Black River requires that all graduating students successfully pass Spanish 3 to graduate. During your time at Black River in middle school, you are required to complete two Spanish courses. Please remember that most colleges like to see at least two full year courses in a foreign language during high school. You may begin Spanish in your 6th or 7th grade year by completing Spanish 1A. After completing that, you will move on to Spanish 1B for your second year and be ready for Spanish 2 in your third year. If you start at Black River later, or begin Spanish later, in 8th grade or above, you will begin instead with Spanish 1 for your first year proceed to Spanish 2 in your second year and be ready for Spanish 3 in your third year. Students are expected to take two courses of fine arts during middle school. Art classes are listed on the left and correlate with both the English and history courses. African and Egyptian art is available to sixth graders, Asian art available to seventh graders, and early European art to eighth graders. In addition, band, choir, and orchestra options are listed with the beginning options at the top of the flowchart. Students will be auditioning for these placements and should be in communication with the music teachers to see where they are and what they should be taking next. Students must also complete a credit in PE and health during middle school. There are a variety of options for students to achieve this. There are full year one credit courses in PE that students may take. Sixth grade PE is offered for sixth graders and middle school PE is offered for all middle school students. There are G-Block courses that also help meet the requirement, including cardiovascular health. Middle school students may also combine activities to earn their PE credit. If you participate in two sports seasons, that fulfills the requirement. You may also log 80 hours of physical activity to turn into the school. You should choose A through F block courses to fill your schedule during registration. You should have six total A through F block courses. Most students will have five core classes and one elective. 
You should then choose your G-Block courses for each semester and be sure to list them in your order of preference. Label them 1 for your first choice, 2 for second choice, and 3 for third. This will complete your registration. The final slide of this presentation focuses on advanced math. Advanced in math, or are seeking to become advanced in math, the high school math flowchart is listed on this slide. You'll want to speak with your current math teacher to discuss your next step. This concludes the middle school registration presentation. If you have any questions, please ask your CAP teacher, the current teacher you have in the subject you're interested in, or a guidance counselor for help. Thank <music> you.